<laughs> uh, we are playing Freddy the Fish. Where? Oh, Freddy Fish is too big. Hold on. Don't look at me. fish. I... what in the world? Why is it like this? Hold on. I didn't... I didn't want it crop, I just wanted it... Okay, well, we'll do this then. Wait. What the heck? Come on. We're having a technical difficulty. I don't know what's going on, apparently- Do you think your cousin Calico will teach me to throw a lasso? I'm sure she will. This is going to be great! I've never played this particular Freddy Fish before. Um... So... We'll see what happens. Uh, I guess they're going to visit Freddy's cousin, who owns a ranch? Yeah, Freddy Fish. Hi. Hi, Maggie. Yeah, we're playing Freddy Fish. I've never played this Freddy Fish before, so I don't know the plot. I know the plot of most of the other ones, though. Um, I think it wouldn't let me like pause the cutscene at first or anything. Um, but I think they're going to Freddy's cousin's house, who's a rancher. And they were joking about how Luther is so small he can't wear a 10-gallon hat. He needs a 5-gallon hat. Uh, yeah, it's the same company. Um, what's it called? It has, like, the exclamation point logo. Just think, Luther. Pretty soon we'll Big be idea? a real wrench in. I can't remember. I'm raring to go. Me too. There's Cousin Calico's ranch! We're gonna be ranchers soon! Gosh, Luther. I'm glad you're here with me. I'm glad, too. Boy, I sure am hungry. You're always hungry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Me, too, actually. Uh, I got home from the gym, and I had fries and a shake. Oh, that's neat. You could tell this is a game made for kids just because you could click on shit over and over again for it to do stuff. Here. Hi, 
Captain Calico. Oh, hello, Freddy. Howdy, Luther. We're ready to help out. Which way to the hogfish? Well, it seems we got a little problem there. See, my prize-winning hogfish herd is being rustled. Rustled? What does that mean? Somebody came and took them without asking. Ah, uh, don't look not at me. Right. No, it's not. Need to move and this. a hogfish requires proper care. I think they might be in real trouble. I just don't know what to do. There you Did go. you call the police? I think the sheriff's gone out of town. And I need to stay here at the ranch in case the hogfish get away and come home. Not to mention all the worrying I have to do. We'll help you, Cousin Calico. I need to get Luther the license for this to get rid of this little floating. And catch those rustlers. Yeah! Thank you both. You'll be doing me a real good turn. Did you see the rustlers who took your hogfish, Cousin Calico? No, but you might ask some of the folks in town. Maybe they saw something. So the hogfish darn got rustled. Look, Freddy! A purple, purple sea, sea urchin! urchin. I remember, I just remember this stuff from... We're rich! From when I was a kid. I remember the purple sea urchins. They, I think, uses the money in this world. So sometimes you could trade them for things. Here we are in Briny Gulch. This must be the town square! Let's go ask some of the people who live here if they know anything about those rustlers. They're so small, they look so silly. Just... Ultra... I wish I could ultra zoom in right here, I don't know how to do that quite yet. Just for, like, this is a reaction image. Hold on, I think I could get a reaction image. Ah, no, don't look at me! Oh no, where am I? There we are. Customers! <clears throat> Hello and welcome to Just Buckles! I'm Nelson Tosso. How can I help you today? I'm Freddy, and this is Luther. And we're helping my cousin, Calico Catfish. Rustlers took all of her hogfish. <gasps> Rustlers? Well, I wouldn't know anything about that. Oh, I think he might know something about that. What's that big thing? Eh? Oh, that, that's, um, it's a personal project. Nothing important. What are these plans? Oh, those are the blueprints for the custom belt buckles I make. They feature a stylish arching metal back with a personalized letter on the front. Any letter the customer wants! I'll bet they look nice. Oh, they're very popular. Did you see this picture? It's my son, Half Nelson. He was real cute as a baby, don't you think? He has your forearm. Name Half Nelson? It says just buckles. Do you work out a lot? Why, um, no. Making buckles is hard work. Me going, so me coming really home from the gym and out. showing off. We'll have this case solved in no time. Just let us know if you hear anything that might help us, okay? Sure. So, like, even though I played these as a kid, I was never able to beat one of them. So maybe this time I'll actually beat the game. I do hate how every time I have to tab over, though, you see my tracking. Is 
Is that what I think it is? I think. Oh. Freddy Fish, and this is I haven't. Friend Luther. I didn't or even know that was a thing. Of the Santa Clara Squids, and these would be Perry and Ape. I didn't even know you could speed run these. <gasps> er, uh, Apricot. Some rustlers took my cousin Togfish. Have you seen or heard anything suspicious? Rustlers taking your cousin Togfish sounds mighty suspicious to me now already. Now I need to look it up. I want, like, maybe one day I'll become a pro Freddy Fish speedrunner. It's a nice kind of pale blue color. <laughs> Youngsters, I'm Saltwater 31. Stella, owner and operator of the Soda Lube. What can I do for you? We wanted to it ask has to you be. if you've seen of any course it's rustlers exploits. around here lately. Rustlers? Well, there were a couple of suspicious characters in here yesterday. They might have been rustlers. They like the, op the opening of a right game takes 30 there. seconds. <laughs> oh boy, maybe they left a clue. Thank you. Maybe this is a clue. We're gonna do a we full full percent, like hundred percent speed run of Freddy Fish. Memorize the combination and then okay, that makes more sense. Note, six two zero. I'll bet the rustlers left this. I wonder why they didn't eat the note like it says. It probably tastes like paper. We'll hang on to it. That combination must be important. What can I do for you kids? One tumbleweed soda, please. You bet. Thanks anyway. Sorry about the mask. That's okay. Happens all the time. I should probably stop serving drinks that way. It's just too much fun. That's kind of like a horror. Oh, I didn't want to order again. One vanilla beet soda, please. Coming right up. Hey, hey. Thanks anyway. That's all right. Can I can I catch it when it comes by? One Loganberry soda, please. One soda on the house. Can Ready? I catch it? Can I catch Here it? Here it comes. Okay. Nope. Oh. oh. Ouch. Mm. We did it. Oh, oh, what is this? <laughs> okay. That was that was good. That was comedy. I'm already failing the speed run by doing the optional content. Hi, I'm Fred.
Daddy, and this is my pal Luther. Well, hello. Eight fingered Phil. Doctor of Piano Ology. At your service. Stella at the counter said she saw some suspicious looking types in here yesterday. Did you see anything? We think they might have been rustlers. Rustlers? No, I wouldn't know a thing about that. I know the piano, and it knows me, but that's about it. Sorry. I can't help you out. That's okay. Thanks anyway. <sighs> yeah. Hi. It's me. Listen. I want to talk to you about that note. He knows. Meet at the Rusty Rustler at high tide. Memorize the combination and then eat this note. Six two zero. Too bad it's not four two zero. Road closed due to construction. Back shortly. Oh, come oh. on. Let's check out that hatch. Okay. So now I know how to get in. This shouldn't be too hard. We just have to punch in the combination. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two. <sighs> we did it! it I don't think that was very secure anyway. Boy, but... I'll say! I guess the lock was the only thing holding the door on. Tom Thornet, what's that racket? Someone's coming! Hurry! The note. Aw, oh, fiddlesticks. Oh, and he's got the belt, the custom belt buckle, you the see? The door came off again. So the guy does know. Well, I guess I'll just have to The belt buckle maker does on. know. You see? I wonder if they still called it standing guard if you're sitting down. That must be one of the rustlers. I hear the hogfish in there. Let's go, Luther. It's rustlers only in the hideout. Oops, I didn't think I was supposed to say it was a hideout. We might be rustlers. How do you yeah, know? Yeah, the hogfish are just rustlers? straight up in there. That's easy. You're not dressed like rustlers. If you were a rustler, you'd have a 10 gallon hat like mine, a belt buckle like mine. So, like, and the guy makes belt buckles only for rustlers. All rustlers are definitely rustlers. exactly alike. Yep, we all wear the latest rustler gear. From Ru you WrestleMania. This picture you can see in that WrestleMania, WrestleMania magazine. Hmm. An orange ten-gallon hat, a big old belt buckle okay. with an L on it, and a bow tie. L for what? Since okay. So we things, need to use the ink for so the hat. But where do we get the hat? Because this hat out is for rustlers only. Yeah, he can't only. wear a ten-gallon. He's too small. We gotta wear okay. a five-gallon. Thank you. This is the rustler hideout, all right. I'm sure the hogfish are inside. What we heard the hogfish. We, we heard them. To get some new clothes. Yeah, we we can't progress the game. Hey, Freddy, can we eat this note now, like it says? Well, I guess we won't need the combination anymore. Luther, what the hell? Well. I can see why the rustlers didn't eat it. It tasted like paper. The game's kind of funny, actually. I think there's some comedy here. See anything? Hmm. 
Oh, oh. All right, you hogfish. Quiet down or else. Or else I'm calling Mr. Big. <gasps> Wait, so... Did you hear something? The hogfish... It was probably just the current. I guess. The hogfish are also fish. How are they different from these fish? They seem to understand speech. So this is what we need to look like wrestlers. Hmm. An orange 10 gallon hat, a big old belt buckle with an L on it, and a bow tie. We don't have any of those things. We'd better get cracking. How much would it cost to have a custom belt buckle made? Well, seeing as how you said you're Calico's cousin and all, I'd do the job for free if you brought me the materials. Thank you, Nelson. That's very generous. Okay, so yeah, Nelson it. and half Nelson. This is just a big wrestling... A big wrestling meme. Okay, so we need the materials. Can you tell me again what pieces you need to make a belt buckle? Sure! I just need a piece of metal shaped like this for the back and whatever letter you want on the front. So I need a letter L from somewhere. I need a belt. Can we go? We can't go down here. Is there anything in here? Can we take your hat? Cousin Calico, we saw one of the rustlers. You did? They're at the old ship, the Rusty Rustler. That's good work, both of you. Any sign Who would have thought the, the rustlers fish? would have I'm been at the sure Rusty the Rustler? Sure, the fish are there too. We could get inside and rescue them if we looked more like rustlers. Dress like rustlers, eh? That sounds like a good plan. But how do you know what a rustler looks like? Oh, we have a picture. Oh, good. Oh, we have a picture? But can I, like, take anything? Can, do you have anything? Am I gonna get stuck? Oh, can we take one of these? No. Okay, um... I'm already gonna get stuck, just like I did when I was a kid, because I'm stupid. Gee, Lothar, you're- I don't care. I only care about getting my sh my stuff. Is this open yet? Yes, okay. I guess whoever was working here is done now. It'd be nice to, like, have somebody say that. That's a nice screwdriver you have there. Thanks! Do you think we could borrow it for a while? No, we might need it to work on this dance floor. Maybe later, when it's finished. You two look like you've got trouble. <laughs> you could say that again. We made this floor for the big square. Oh, is it a hammer? Hammer Only we found chart? out it has to be well square. And we are out of wood. We need some more to start over. A piece about seven feet by seven feet ought to do it. A piece by seven feet by seven feet. Gum nuts. Gum nuts. Gum nuts. Gum nuts. Gum nuts. Gum nuts. We're having a special today on Super Rubber Bubble Bubble Gum. Just two purple sea urchins per pack. Nuts? Our Fickle Fit Wheel Nuts are only three purple sea urchins each. You won't find a lower price this side of the Marianas Trench. Gum nuts. Gum nuts. Good evening, ma'am. Sir. Allow me to introduce myself. 
How can he tell? My name is Gil mind. Barker, and I represent the Balboxy Premium Gum and Wheel Nut Company, third largest distributor of bubble gum and wheel nuts in the Upper Western Hemisphere. Gum nuts. Gum nuts. I'm Freddie Fish, and this is my gum pal nuts. Luther. Gum nuts. Gum nuts. My employers have authorized me to clear out my inventory to make room for next year's models. Everything must go. Therefore, I, Gil Barker, will be offering you prices so outrageously low that you'll have to bend over to see them. Gum nuts. Gum nuts. Great. Friendly reminder to Gil Barker. You owe Shady Shark 20 clams. <gasps> Pay up pronto. What's this? Oh, that's, uh, that's nothing. It's a poem I was writing. That's an awfully strange poem. Everybody here is just, like, ready to eat paper. This, this doesn't do anything even though it's highlighted. Oh, hey! Oh, boy! A real 10-gallon hat! Thief! Gosh, I'm sorry. I didn't know there was anyone under there. You could have knocked! On a hat? Oops, that's not... Oh, okay. Slack Tooth Clifford. Wanted Slack Tooth Clifford by the sheriff and the county for the discourteous offense of stagecoach, Brandon. Wanted wrong Finn Zelda by the sheriff and the county for the discourteous offense of halibut, biting. Halibut, biting. Halibut, biting. Halibut, biting. Hello? Wow, that's amazing. You should see my brother. Why can't we go in? Ew. Ew. I know, you right? You could let us buy. She can't but help I it. Can't. Why is that? I think I'm stuck. Oh. He's stuck? I don't... Okay. <laughs> the map actually feels quite large. Watch out for the jellyfish, Luther. They can sting you. Okay. Ouch! There must be a way to get off. I thought I timed it well, we but whatever. Made it. I knew we could do it. Oh boy! I see another purple sea urchin. It's a crank handle. What's it doing here all by itself? Shouldn't it be attached to something? Yeah, I doubt it belongs in this cave. I wonder how it got in here anyway. I do like the Good color... Question. Uh, the, the color theory going on in this cave. Do I have to... Oh, they're just fine, okay. Oh, yeah, this is... We can't go in here. Let's see if I could figure this out. Oh, 
Oh, here's a bow tie. My name's Freddy Fish, and this is my best pal, Luther. Howdy, kids. Folks call me Sahara Slim, professional traveling man and blues musician. Musician? Do you play an instrument? Harmonica. Well, where is Whatever it? Whatever you're cooking smells good. It's Sahara Slim special super stew. My own recipe. I could go for a good stew right now. It's kind of cold. <sighs> oh. Oh. Not quite ready. Oh. Where's your harmonica, Slim? We'd like to hear you play. Well, I got a little song about that. Listen here. Oh, I used to play harmonica all the live long day. But now I miss my Monica. I traded it away. Yes, I traded my harmonica, the apple of my. I traded away my Monica for a ratty old bow tie. You traded your harmonica for a bow tie? Yeah, I wish I hadn't now. Maybe we could get his bow tie by getting his harmonica back. Okay. Hello? Are you the mailman? No. Oh, what kind of I'm voice is Freddy this? Fish. Go away. I'm waiting for an important package. I'm waiting for an important package. Oh, no. It's missing a handle on the lid. That's why the lid won't shut. It's missing a handle on the lid. I don't think I need that right now. That's a crank. Oh, the mail. Oh, the mail. Hi, I'm Freddy Fish, and this is my best buddy, Luther. <laughs> Hello, I'm you. That's silly. You're not Freddy. No, you like the letter U. Just you? Is it short for something? Yes, it's short for Uriah, Jedediah, Euripides, Algernon, Fortescue, Forsyth, and... <laughs> Um, no, now what was the rest of it? Um, we'll just call you you. Most folks do. It's addressed to E. Tippett. Can we just take the mail hey, to you. him? That's your wagon over there, right? Yep, it broke down, so I'm delivering the mail on foot. Takes a little longer that way, though. We could just carry it right there. If I wait. How long has it been since your wagon broke down? Little over two years. It looks like you've gone about five feet since then. Yep, making pretty good time, pretty good time. Can we wait for him to go across the screen? Will he, will he move? It looks like he's moving. It looks like the wheel on this wagon has fallen off. Maybe we can fix it. <sighs> the wheel looks like it just needs a new nut to hold it onto the wagon. A nut. We need a nut. We could. I need, think I need one more sea urchin to buy a nut. Are what? you ready to start? Huh? Here's a fun game. Pop the bubbles before they run into you. Sixty nine, we gotta stop. No. Oh. Okay, come get me. Come get me. We're at the ideal score. Kill me. No, why? How did I get more? Because the bubble hit me, I got more points. That's so messed up. That's so messed up. Hey, 
Luther. What's round and purple and pokey? It, is it on me? No, silly. It's a purple sea urchin over there. Oh. Now I could buy a bolt for the thing. I wasn't afraid. It's a bone. <laughs> it's a bone. It's a bone. It's a bone. It's a it's a it's a it's a it's a it's a bone. 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 It's a it's a it's a bone. It's a it's a bone. It's a bone. It's a it's a bone. It's a it's a bone. I'm a what? It's an old shoe. It's an old tire. It's an anchor. It's just a pile of junk. <laughs> Yikes! He must be really hungry. So I can't go by. Doesn't he have anything better to do? Maybe if we give him something to eat, we can swim past him while he's busy. Good idea. That's not food. Ah! Boy, that was fast. I don't think that was enough time for us to swim past. Oh, maybe no, we could give him the gum and he'll be so. chewing it for a long time? So, can we go this way as well? Oh! They said, uh, seven it by seven, right? Seven feet by seven feet. Can, Look, I, Luther, can I have it? Another purple sea urchin! It's free! Boy, somebody's been leaving these all over the place! It says, free wood. This should be useful. How did you ah. do that? That's my special secret. Ah. Um. Hmm. Hmm. That sure is interesting. Oh, was this crank? Wood crank. belong somewhere. that do? Oh, Pajama Sam! Putt-putt. Oh, um, Spy Fox. I never got to play Spy Fox when I was younger. Maybe my parents were worried about me becoming a furry. is filled with water now. I don't 
I'm not quite sure that's how things work. What does that what does that do? I don't understand. Oh, because I could go over here now? Okay, so now oh, I could buy all my stuff. Another purple sea urchin. You think they just grew here or something? Luther, they do just grow here. Imagine really? if you could just get money. Wow. Like off the ground. What? What is that? It's lemongrass. Is that anything like lemonade? That's not what lemongrass looks like. It's a little like. more sour than lemonade is. Boy, you're not kidding. I kind of like it, though. It's TV static. Really? Freddy, what? Huh? 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 Shoo! Bless you. Wow! Wow! Blood. It's Cayenne. Cayenne? Um, Cayenne is kind of hot. Okay, Rip Luther. It feels like my tongue's on fire! Is it? No, it looks okay. Whew. Okay, so we came in through the window, I think. Oh, so we could feel... Okay. Power. I don't know if we need that yet. MSG. Oh, 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 there's no L. M. S. I wonder what we could use to get those screws out. Oh, okay, so they're screwed Look on. Look at this cute spice container. This could come in handy. Yeah, I haven't played Overwatch in a long time. Much more likely that it's Freddy Fish. So can I fill this up with... I don't know what we're using it for there. yet. There! One container of cayenne. Oh yeah, we're just bubbling over here. You know, underwater. Um, keep them on ice until I get back. Stop. Sign it. You know who. And deliver it right away. Oh, we're putting yes, the pepper in his pot. Yes, sir. Oh. <clears throat> oh, hi, kids. Hello. How would you like some cayenne? Say, that would be great. <laughs> this is gonna be delicious. So does he eat it? Harmonica, harmonica. To play you was to kiss you. Ooh. But now all I have is this old bow tie. Harmonica, how I miss you. Why did you trade away your harmonica if you liked it so much? Well, I really wanted a bow tie back then. Now I. 
trade back in a second. Oh. Say, oh. I think the super stew is about ready. Would you like to try some? Why is it black? <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Smooth. It's very strong. Interesting. I knew you like it. So is that all we get out of it? That's not gonna do me any good. Here, can you use this piece of wood for your floor? Say, that looks about right. Perfect. Thanks a lot. We owe you one. You're that welcome. That means the fish are like... That's seven feet by seven feet. Those fish are like nine feet long. Okay, this is funny. I do like this. Work here is done. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Coffee break? Exactly. I think they're uh they're partners. Like they're gay. Now that your floor is finished, do you think we can borrow your screwdriver for a while? Sure. In fact, you can keep it. Consider it payment for a job well done. Gee, thanks. We'd like to buy your pack of bubble gum, please. Excellent, excellent. Super rubber bubble is the most durable gum on the market. You won't be disappointed. Now, the gum is two purple sea urchins. So you can give me the second one right away. Or if you like, I can start a gum layaway plan for you. And I'll give you the gum when you pay me the balance. That's fair. Here's the other purple sea urchin for the pack of gum. Splendid, splendid. Here you go. It's my last pack. Maybe even the last pack in the entire hemisphere. You've made a wise uh, purchase. Thank you. No refunds. Now it's just nuts. We'd like to buy one of your wheel nuts, please. Certainly. Now, the nuts cost three purple sea urchins, so I'll start you on one of our nut layaway plans. And you can have your nut when you've paid me the other two <laughs> purple sea urchins. You gotta have your nut. And may I say that a fickle fit wheel nut is really an excellent investment. Yes, we have two. Here's another purple sea urchin towards our wheel nut. Very good. Let's see. That leaves only one more purple sea urchin before the fabulous fickle fit wheel nut is all yours. We have one purple sea urchin. Here's the last purple sea urchin for our wheel nut. Can we have it now? Of course! You can select any shape you like. And if it doesn't work out for you, you can bring it back and exchange it for a different one. This one looks good. Thank you. No, thank you! Can we buy another wheel nut? We don't need another wheel nut. Good evening, sir. May I interest you in... You got the 20 clams you owe me, Gil? Uh, not exactly. How much is not exactly? I've got a few purple sea urchins. You know, my dogfish needs an operation. Don't worry. I've got a really big deal uh, about to go down. Yeah? 
What is it? Well, all I can say is, it's really big. I'll have your clams in a couple of days. Well, okay. Whatever you got going, I hope it's good. This is kind of screwed up. Oh, it? it is. It's real good. <sighs> I hope I got the right kind of nut. This nut isn't the right shape to fit in the wheel. We'll have to try a different oh, one. Oh, so I have to get a round one. Why did they do that? I couldn't even look at the shape before. Here. So is this like an animal or a person? Teaching children about the importance of money. Yeah. And like don't don't use loan sharks cuz they'll destroy you. That ought to keep that shark busy for a while. Yeah. Actually, he looks very happy. stars. Can we take one of these starfish with us? Sure. Do I need a certain color? Freddy, let's take this starfish instead of the other one. Okay. I can't remember things. Wait, no. Let's get yellow because it's like a share of star. That's the only thing I could think of. Let's take this starfish instead of the other one. Okay. Could we exchange this nut for a different one? Certainly! Here at Biloxi Premium, we're in the business of serving our customers. <laughs> you can select this one. This one looks good. Thank you. No, thank you. Can we buy another wheel nut? We don't need another wheel nut. Oh yeah, and he needs a new home. What was going on over here again? <laughs> the cave, we don't need any more. I need to just take notes or something. I'm not good at remembering anything. Oh yeah, and... Maybe if I shake some pepper in this guy's face. Here, try some cayenne. Thanks. Mm. Ah, spicy. So sour, maybe? Or no, pepper, probably? I forgot about that. My speed run is over.
We did it. It's fixed, and it'll stay on there, right? We don't have to use any glue or anything. Careful there. Don't ever mention G-L-U-E around oh. old Elmer. Spooks him something awful. What's he got against glue? <laughs> oh, no. I can't believe this. Kids wouldn't understand that. Rip. My package at last. Oh, okay. Mr. Tippett, do you think we could have this old mailbox door now that you're not using it anymore? Sure. Take it and leave me to hermit in peace. Thank you. Okay, so... Go here. Fill this with pepper. Fill it with TV static. There! One container of pepper. <laughs> Here, try it. But it's chocolate. <laughs> but it's chocolate. Take the other ones too. I really only need one letter, but we need it. It's a pig. I really like those hats. Hmm. An orange 10 gallon hat, a big old belt buckle with an L on it, and a bow tie. We don't have any of those things. We'd better get cracking. It's a screwdriver. None of those could be made into an L. Try some pepper. <gasps> Gee, I hope he's okay. I haven't seen anybody sneeze like that since that kid got a worm doodle up his nose at school. That oh, I forgot about worm doodles. Wilter. Oh, yeah. Oh, there we go. I really 
only need one letter. Broken? I think maybe you just need some lessons. And this mm. is kelp, which I think makes this kelp grass. It looks. I think that was in another game. M. That poor kid got launched somewhere. Would you like this harmonica? Would I? Oh, boy! Oh, this is great! Oh, here, have this lovely bow tie in exchange with my compliments. Thanks. Okay, don't know what the starfish does. Thank you so much. Now, I can play the blues again. All right, you hogfish, pay attention. to a lot of trouble and expense to hire these sheep head to jump over this fence for you. So count them and go to sleep. Please. Please just go to sleep. Please. Sheriff shrimp, but now I guess it's just plain shrimp. What okay, happened okay. to the sheriff part? They took my silver star. Silver, Can't be a sheriff silver. without a silver star. Folks <sighs> won't respect you. Maybe we could help you get your star back. Yeah. I'll tell you what. This county would owe you a great service if you did. Silver. It's the other way. Ugh, man. I should have talked to him more. I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I'm lost.
Where am I? I'm so lost. I know where I'm going. This way, this way. Silver. I like this silver starfish. Let's take it instead of the other one. It's just like the one the sheriff was talking about. Here, I believe this is yours. My starfish! Yahoo! Okay, so it's... we found the L. We found the L. Anything you need. I had to trade the M for Just it. Ask. And then the... I mean, the M could have been a W because it was upside down. So we did have the W for a while. Now, if you'll excuse me, there are laws to be enforced. Rustlers to be found. Sheriff Shrimp is back in town. But we know where the rustlers are. You there. That's a loading zone. Looks like it's still up to us to catch those rustlers and rescue the hogfish. Let's ride. Yeah. Oh, boy. A 10-gallon hat. This is great. See, I Luther can't fit in it. It's too big. Hat. Yeah, maybe you're right. Okay, so I think we have everything we need. I just have to dye the hat orange. Gobi, I'm at my wit's end. These hogfish are driving me crazy. They won't eat or sleep. And they're so noisy. Where'd they get the accordion? <laughs> Uh, I don't know. Did you Where try did telling them get that story the about your trip to Akron? That always puts me to sleep. Oh, thanks a lot. I'm going to have to call Mr. Big again. Oh. the belt buckle out of this? <gasps> sure. Just bring me a letter to put on it and I'll get to work. Here, this is for the belt buckle. Of course he sells okay. these for free for us. We had to get the materials and everything. All he's doing is hammering it on. Yikes! 
Hold on, let me check my blueprints. This is very scientific. Oh, he didn't even my hammer it in. He puts work. glue on All it. All that's missing is a belt. Here you go. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Mr. Torso. Please, call me Nelson. All I ever wanted was to be a hogfish rancher. I had no idea it would be so much work. Maybe there are some tricks to it that we don't know about. Yeah? Well, I'm going back in. Don't let any non-rustlers inside, okay? Radio! I like how he has shading and he doesn't. Like, do they just not care? Are you sure you don't know anything about the rustlers? I heard that rustlers took some hogfish belonging to the cousin of a young girl near here. I haven't seen them, but if I was looking, I'd look in the soda loom. That's kind of disgusting. They're really extending this, too. I think it looks nicer now. Ugh. big for you but do i look like a ruffler oh yes that's even better than before good i'm like why do most fish walk yeah, upright but freddy bone. has to like now, swim like normal rescue those hogfish yeah luther you stay here while I try to get past the guard. Wait, I'm coming with you. Good thinking, Luther. Let's try to get past the guard. Hold it! This is a... Well, howdy, fellow wrestler. Ahem, howdy. I reckon Mr. Big must have sent you to help us out with the hogfish, right? Um... Poor Mori, he's having a terrible time with the hogfish. Well, go on in. He'll be glad to see you. Thank you. We did it! Shh! We did it! We're inside! Which way do you think the hogfish are? <laughs> Well, I think I hear squealing coming from... Hey! You two aren't rustlers! What are you doing here? Um, we were just leaving. You're not going anywhere! Mr. Big will know what to do with you! I think Mr. Big has been in other stuff. Is he an octopus, if I remember correctly? Nobody knows the trouble I've seen! What do we do now? You took all my stuff. It didn't even budge. Nope, this door is definitely locked. Hey, it looks like there might be a way out under all these cannonballs. Phew, these are heavy. Do I have to do it one at a time? Oh gosh. Okay, good. There! That does it. Yeah! 
Oh, they're here. Hey, look! Here they are! These are the missing I'm, I'm books. the one up on the right, middle we're right. Missing. We know just where we are. What? They could talk? So they are just fish. What? They are just fish. Did you come to rescue us? That's right. Good. The food in here is terrible. So... The rancher... The, the rancher raises the hogfish, but the hogfish are just fish. They could talk, and they're just normal fish. So why is she raising them? By the way, I'm Freddy, and this is Luther. My name's Gruntle. I'm glad you're going to rescue us. It's really crowded in here. I didn't know hogfish chewed bubblegum. One of the rustlers brought a whole bunch of it for us. I think he thought it was a normal part of our diet. Hmm, that's very interesting. Is that super rubber bubble bubble gum that you're all chewing? That sounds right. I thought it might be. So do we take him up? They're like parents and they've learned the language, but they could just communicate, like, fluently. That door is still locked. You're right, Luther. There's got to be some other way out of this room. Maybe we can get the hogfish out through this hole. The hogfish won't fit through there, but it looks like you and I can. I guess we'll have to work out another way to get those hogfish out. They'll need a bigger opening. Do I need to get the crank I again? I what this does. Oh. Neat! I like the I like the pig noises in the music. That anchor looks really heavy. I'll bet that weighs six tons. What does that mean? That means it's really heavy. Oh. Maybe we can find a way to yank those bars out. We could put the anchor in. I think I see something behind this thing. You're right. I can't see it very well. The rudder's in the way. I think we have to move this rudder if we're going to get that thing out of there. How do I move the rudder? There must be an easier way to move it. Is it like up here? I okay. Did you hear something? Like a creaking noise? I think it came from out there. Look at this neat hook! Do you think maybe it belonged to a pirate? I don't know, but I bet it will come in handy. Here, why don't you hang on to it? Okay. Um, okay, so how to like this up? Okay. Let's 
So can I get the anchor back up? I wonder if this will bring the anchor back up. Okay, okay. I'm gonna attach this to this. I bet if we attach this hook to the chain, it'll reach those bars. Rock. Now I just press the button. This should free those hogfish. Luther, prepare to drop anchor. Ready, Freddy! Fire away! They're free! They're what? screaming! No! Come back! Please come back! We're going home. The food's terrible here. Oh, what do we do now, Maury? <laughs> I think you should give yourselves up. You're under arrest in the name of the law! Law? What law? Yeah, I don't see any law. Then I suggest you turn around! Real slow like. It's Sheriff Shrimp. Yeah, wow, everybody's just here. About everybody in town, it looks like. Youngsters, that was mighty fine work apprehending these two. I'll be taking them off to jail now. You boys ought to be ashamed of yourselves. Hold on, Sheriff. There's one more person involved with the rustling. Yeah, that's right. They kept talking to somebody called Mr. Big. I never saw his face, but he was in charge. He planned the rustling and everything. Is that so? Well, what if it is? We'll never reveal the identity of Mr. Big. Yeah, you'll never catch him. Actually, I know who Mr. Big is. He's right here in the room. Oh, so Mr. Big's not the not When the, the rustlers caught Luther and me, they called Mr. Big to come and decide what to do with us. I suspect he was already here when you all arrived and just slipped in with the posse. Well, which one is it then? It has to be one of these two. But he was all... I suspect Mr. Fingers! Whoa! No way, baby! I don't know rustling, just piano playing. After we found the note to the rustler saying to meet here, we heard you call them to talk about it. Note? The only call I made about a note was about a musical note. A musical note? Well, yeah, see, I got a bet going with old Seven Finger Charlie from the Plankton Hut about this one particular note in a ragtime tune. He thinks it's a B-flat, but really, it's an A-flat. Big difference. Okay, so it's you, because you're big. I'll bet it's Nelson Torso. Oh, uh, but, uh, but, um... Business hasn't but, um, been very good at just buckles lately, has it? Well, no, but... And I noticed that you were building a barbell at your shop. Big enough for hogfish, maybe? No. You see, everyone thinks I keep in such great shape at my shop. I'm starting to get a little flabby. So, the barbell... It's for me, yes! Why would the barbell be for a hogfish? <gasps> but I'm not a rustler! No, he isn't. B flat! Nelson? Not an A flat. flat. Yes, but no, it's not him. Then which one of us is it? Mr. Big must be Sahara Slim. I assure you, I'm not your perpetrator. We saw you sending a telegram. You said, keep them on ice. Yep, that was about some suspects in another case. You see, I'm here undercover. I'm actually Sahara Slim, under Sea Marshal. <laughs> I sure didn't expect that. I'm here investigating possible violations of the undersea coffee break statutes. <coughs> I guess you're probably not a rustler then. That was smart to notice the telegram, but he's not Mr. Big. So who is? Who's Mr. Big? 
What in the world? Is it Sheriff Shrimp? As the sheriff, he'd probably understand the criminal mind better than anyone. That's true, I do. But I'm no rustler. Yes, it's not the sheriff. Well, who is it then? I'm so confused. Mr. Parker, you've been in some financial trouble lately, haven't you? What makes you say that? Luther and I overheard you talking to a loan shark about it. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> We also read your IOU. Even though you tried to tell us it was a poem, you rustled the hogfish to pay off your debts, didn't you? Yeah, I'm afraid I did. That doesn't make any sense. That doesn't make any sense at all. What was it that first tipped you off? It was the gum. You had an awfully small oh. supply for a gum salesman. And I got to wondering what had happened to oh, the Oh, and this was the big the deal he was going to be on. still chewing it when we got here. Yeah, Super Rubber Bubble lasts a long time. It's a fabulous product, which is why I borrowed money to invest in it. But the sales weren't so good, and I was going to have to declare bankruptcy. I figured even if I couldn't sell the hogfish, I could at least get into hogfish ranching, which, as you know, is a much more respectable profession than sales. Well, that's no excuse. You all ought to be ashamed. You just shouldn't take things. Wow, that Luther don't was saying Freddy to. lines. It hurts other I think they use the same cutscene for wrong. everything, You're and right. it doesn't work. We're they just sorry. stopped talking. We didn't want to be rustlers. All we ever really wanted was to be hogfish ranchers, but we don't know how. Ranchers, you say? You know, I do still need some help out at my place. I'm glad this worked out so well for everyone. Freddy, Luther, I can't thank you enough for all you've done here. The hogfish are home safe. And the rustlers is brought to justice. Yeehaw! How's their immunity service working out? That's community service, son. Oh, yeah. How's that going? I think they're coming along quite well. <coughs> And now the hogfish are pigs again? Like, what? It's hard work, but when I'm done with them, they'll be real hogfish ranchers. Can we learn to be hogfish ranchers, too? Of course. Here, I've got something for you. Ten gallon hats? Yours is a five gallon. So Haha, <laughs> because he's right. small. Oh, boy! Now, come on, you two. I'll show you how to tie a lasso. Oh, give me a home where the buffalo roam, where the deer and the antelope This is a little bit eerie. Do you really want to restart the game? Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I guess we'll just stop then. Do you really want to quit? Ah, uh, now you can see me again. Okay. Well, thanks for coming in, Maggie. It was fun. We finally beat a game this year, and it's Freddy Fish 4, and it took an hour and a half stream to do it. So, uh, I don't know what we're going to do next time, but I just wanted to stream with something today. So now I have this. Uh, thanks for coming along, and, um, let's see, is anybody streaming right now? Nope, all of my friends are offline. Uh, I don't know, I guess no raid, I mean, I only have you anyways, so I don't want to send you somewhere strange. Uh, but yeah, thanks for coming. Um, hopefully I'll be able to stop into one year soon. Maybe not this week because I'm going to be working the rest of the week because it's New Year's and it's going to suck, but, uh, hopefully soon. <laughs> so. <sighs> uh, I need a nap or something or a shower because I didn't shower after the gym. I just went straight to playing Freddy Fish and eating fries. Um. But yeah, I'll see you later. Thanks for coming.